Hi, uh, we're here to talk about strawberry shortcake today. Uh, of course, everybody's enjoyed strawberry shortcake on a nice hot summer day, and we're going to show you how to make it. Uh, first thing you need is you need some strawberries. I've got some uh, Driscoll strawberries that I bought from the grocery store. Uh, I've also got some angel food cake. Um, and of course whipped cream. Today we're going to try making our own whipped cream. So this is some uh, organic heavy whipping cream. Alright, so the first step is to wash the strawberries. Let's go to the sink and wash the strawberries. Okay, so we're going to wash the strawberries. I've got a bowl here and uh, we're just going to dump these in here. And rinse them off because that's going to get off any you know, bad things we don't want on there. Pesticides, dirt, anything we don't want. There we go, and just drain it out. And we'll move on to the next step, which is uh, cutting the strawberries. Okay, so for the cutting part, I've got a, a small knife here. And uh, since these are a pretty small strawberry, we're going to cut them into halves. And the first step is we're going to cut off the leafy part. Just like that. Um, I, I'm kind of a perfectionist. I don't like these black spots, so I'm just going to cut that off. And then we will find the halfway spot and cut it in half. There we go, just like that. And we will throw away the strawberries. The uh, strawberry top, that is, not the whole strawberry. Alright, this looks like a bad one. I'm going to throw this away, and if you got bad ones like that, you don't have to use them. Okay, so we're going to go through the rest of these, and we'll be back after that. Alright, so we've got our strawberries halved. Next thing we want to do is give it a little bit of flavor. So we're going to use some honey for sweetness, and just for a little kick, we're going to use some Jim Beam bourbon. Alright, so we will just... Put a little bit of honey on there, just a dab, and just for a little interesting flavor, Jim Beam Bourbon. Is that enough? Yeah. All right, and I think we're gonna wrap these in plastic and leave them overnight to marinate, and we'll be back. All right. So next step is we're gonna make our whipped cream. Uh, we have the uh, organic heavy whipping cream and the trick to this if you've only used the uh, canned whipped cream is to stir it up for a long time until it thickens up uh, but to hurry along the process we're going to use the cuisinart. art so i take our whipping cream and just pour it in there i think that's enough and uh, to make it interesting, we're going to mix some of the same ingredients we put into the strawberries. We're going to take the honey and we're going to take the bourbon. And our strawberries have been marinating for 24 hours. I think we got some good taste in there now. So those are going to be ready as well. Here we go. And we'll whip it up. You can kind of tell it's getting thicker. Let's see how it looks. Oh, it looks good. So you can see it's uh, thickened up, and we're gonna scoop, ready to scoop it out. Uh, next step is we are going to cut the cake, and we're gonna plate it. All right, so we've got uh, all our ingredients prepared. 
Uh, next thing we need to do is we need to uh, cut the cake and uh, start our plating process. So let's get our knife, grab a plate, and start cutting. So I'm just going to cut some small slices here. Angel fruit cake is not the easiest to cut. It's so soft. But I'm going to do my best here to get a little piece. There we go. And uh, next thing is we want to put some strawberries on it. So I grab my spoon, grab our marinated strawberries. Put them on the side just like that. And our final step is we are going to get some whipped cream for it from our whipped whipped cream. So it's our whipped cream right there. You can see it in the light, I think. And we're going to grab a dab and put it on there. Alright, 